Hello, welcome everybody. My name is Eva and I'm making mommy lifestyle videos. I'm really, really happy to have you here. I don't know for what reason you click on this video, but I'm very happy you did. I hope you will like and hopefully stay with us because I really enjoy vlogging and making sit down videos. I don't do them as much anymore because life got busy, but if I find time, I would like to go back to it. But anyway, today is a vlog with a pregnancy update. I will start with that just in case you came just for the pregnancy updates and you don't care about the vlogging part. So yeah, let's, let's talk about my 35 weeks and then let's go through the vlog. This is uh, my husband's 34th birthday weekend. So I will be vlogging for a few days up to the Monday and just like put everything together after I update you on my pregnancy. So let me give you an update on my 35 weeks pregnancy. Oh, sorry, here is my dog. I babysit. It's my parents-in-law dog. And here is my daughter, so if you hear her in the background, I apologize. But she needs to be where I am, right? Yes, I am currently 35 weeks pregnant and four days. And I am so over this pregnancy. I don't know what size is the baby, like what vegetable it is. I really don't care. Maybe it was more interesting in first pregnancy, but now I just don't have time for this kind of information. And I also don't know how much the baby weighs or anything like that. My appointment is when I'm 36 weeks ultrasound and a vaginal examination, I guess I can say, to see how the baby's position and if I'm dilated anything, if it's anything happening. So there will be more update next, next week. I will finally have something to talk about. So anyway, that's the stats, I guess. Uh, how I'm feeling? I'm feeling pretty much okay. I'm tired. And I wish it was over, like really, those hi. <laughs> the last four weeks Hi. will go forever. Hi. Hi. I've been counting every single week to the end. Hi. Hi. And now it's only four more. It's kind of exciting and scary. Like, it's definitely scary. Like, look how much energy she has. And I will have a newborn to all of this. But regardless, all the insecurity I'm having right now and all those thoughts, how it's gonna be, I just can't wait for this baby to come. How else I'm feeling? Um, I'm peeing constantly. Like at night, it's just freaking brutal because I feel like I have to go every five minutes. So I feel like I have to go right away if I really have to because my bladder is very weak and I'm just worried I'm gonna wet myself if I won't go right away. Um, what else? What else I can update you on? My belly, it's constantly growing. I feel like it's on lower size than up. But I am not sure. I'm wearing um, breastfeeding bras already because they are just the most comfortable. You can just like unzip them, zip them back. This shirt is from Amazon. I wanted to also have clip like that, but I cheap out and bought like two dollar cheaper shirt, and those didn't have those uh, clips. I didn't realize it, but I left it in the way. They have a very deep uh, U-shape, so you can see my bra, but I don't care. I just want to feel comfortable. 
So, I will show you my belly now. This it is. My 35 weeks belly. I only have one pants for now because they are nice and comfortable. Nice and stretchy. Belly. I still have a belly button. <laughs> it never pop out the same like the first time around. So yeah, this is my belly. That's you. That's a little That's you. And uh, we are going swimming. Today's uh, vlog is uh, the team is um, my husband Bed Stay 34. So follow us around the whole week. Are you ready to go swimming? Just waiting for daddy, always waiting for daddy. I cooked some butternut, squ butternut squash soup. It's basically butternut squash cooked in vegetable broth, in some spices. I put the uh, garlic and uh, uh, ginger, salt and pepper. When the uh, butternut squash soup got, uh, butternut squash vegetable got soft, I blended it with the uh, vegetable broth and then just add some coconut milk to make it uh, more creamy and at the end I also add some other spices so it's very simple even that it's so hot I think it's gonna be great for my daughter for lunch I should be vlogging today but I just don't feel like I discovered that my ankle are swollen. It's first time ever my ankles were never swollen in my last pregnancy and up to this point in this one. So this is something completely new for me and unexpected. My husband uh, went to went for a walk with our daughter so I can rest in bed a little bit and see how everything goes. I didn't really expect it to to feel worse at the last in the last month of my pregnancy. I was really hoping that swelling and all those pregnancy stuff won't apply to me. But I guess I'm not different than anybody else.